muscle with a whale. 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 I done handcuffed lightning, throw thunder in jail. That's bad. That's bad. Only last That's week, bad. I murdered a rock. I have no fear whatsoever of anybody or... Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. What's happening my dear Sunnah Strymphians? So today I'm going to be cooking a lean, mean omelette. So I'm going to be showing you what I've got and I've prepared for my ingredients. So here I've got two sliced uh, chilies. I like it nice and chilly. Nice and cold but hot. Um, I've got six mint leaves. Reason being is that I don't want to overpower the flavour and mints are very strong. They've got, got strong flavour onto that and a small amount of dhania pata or coriander. I've got one whole tomato and make sure you cut it up nicely and finely. And I've got a half of an onion and same again, slice it up really finely. Dice it up, slice it up. That's what we do. And I've got two tablespoon of sweet corn and we got the egg five eggs here and what we're going to do is to keep two yolks for some of the nutrients we don't want too much because it's got high cholesterols in that so we don't want too much yolks we're going to keep the white bit which has which has the protein and that's what we need protein okay this is where the yolk's going to go we don't want to waste the yolks it's ramadan you know and we keep it and we can use it for something else and that's where we're going to mix our ingredients and we've got olive oil extra olive extra virgin olive oil and we're going to put this in the pan and a slight a dot of that so we can give it a nice flavor so we're going to start mixing it up i'm going to crack open the egg <laughs> there we go it's hard enough Nice. Now what we're going to do is get out the yolks and we obviously there's other techniques you can do but I'm not good at that so I use two spoons which I juggle the yolks in one two and we put the yolks in here mm -hmm. Sorry guys, just had a technical glitch. You didn't see me mixing the ingredients, but I've done it. So as you can see, I mixed it in. Make sure you guys get the yolk rubbed in and all the other ingredients. So as you can see, this is how it should be looking, should look like. And I'm gonna put my egg mix in the pan and it's heated up already. So put in lower case, a drop of virgin olive oil, extra virgin, should I say. There we go. Da, 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 da. Get the pan ready to do a fry up. There we go, look at that. Make sure you spread the vegetables and the ingredients. If you want it in one place, make sure you spread it. If you want to cook it, much quicker you want you want to put a lid on for slow heat for three minutes and assess the situation and the ingredients hasn't settled yet it's still soft in, on the top so what, what i did now is i put it in the medium heat and which hopefully will make the top bit harden which will be cooked and be easier to flip so to make it easy to flip over, I'm going to cut it in half. There we go. So I'm going to flip one side. Hopefully this will not break. Oh well. <laughs> oh god. Ugh. Oh no. There we go. Do this. We 
You do a good job flipping around the second one, as you can see, it's all messed up. Mash up. So you do a rubbish job. The second one, the first one is pretty alright. Um, now it should be pretty good to go. And I left it around when I flipped it over around about three minutes. So in medium heat and it looks like it's ready to go. Now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna turn off the gas, is I'm gonna have it for iftar and I'm gonna put it in my naan bread, which is the brown naan bread, and I'm gonna slip it inside. It's finally done, I'm leaving it to cool down. I'm gonna take it to work with the pita bread and I'm gonna have it with that. So you can have this for breakfast, lunch or dinner and you can mix it up with some brown bread, brown pita bread and maybe brown rice. It's up to you what you wanna do with it, but it's very good. It's rich with protein and vitamins. So make sure you implement it after iftar or after Ramadan if you guys wanna have it for breakfast or lunch or dinner. So that's about it. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I'm gonna be enjoying this for iftar. So make sure you don't give me ain't say mashallah. You don't want to get fit a bitch for suhoor or after it's done. So that's about it. Eat clean, get lean, strengthen your dean. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Like us on Facebook and Twitter. We're in our Twitter account. Also what a whale. Out of handcuffed lightning, go thunder. That's bad. Only last week, I murdered a rock. I have no fear whatsoever of anybody.